Jacks are on their way. In an ordinary sofa, in an ordinary room, extraordinary heroes who are standing by to see. Jump. I can do it. I'm not sure. What are the rules again? Look at the pictures. A dog. A cow. And another dog. Now jump to join the two pictures that go together. The two dogs go together. I get it. Try these. Think, then jump. A train. Right. A plane. OK. And a flower. Well, I suppose the plane and the train go together because people can travel on them. Four. What? You're supposed to jump. Oh, I was busy thinking. It's called thinky jump. You have to think and then jump. My turn now. Me, me, me. Ready? Bird. Fish. I did great jumping. But not much thinking. You've got to think and jump. Which things go together? Watch. Apple. Truck. Banana. Apple. Banana. They go together because they are fruit. You can eat them. You couldn't eat a truck. It would hurt your teeth if you tried. I'd try it. You probably would. Agents calling in, come on! Someone spotted a problem! Agent 16 here! I think I've spotted a problem! Hold on, I'm putting it on screen. There's a boy wearing very strange clothes. Looks very strange. And there's this girl. Can't see that look catching on. Right, we better get someone out there. Five knows about fashion. OK, I'll go. The number jacks are on their way. Hey, we've got a problem, what should we do? Who's going out there? Who do we choose? We need to get out there. Who will it be? Who's going out there? Number five. <laughs> Five. I'm fine. Checking it all clear for launching. All clear. Ready? Go! Finding a five to land on. Found a five. Okay, five. I'm fine. And off to sort those clothes out. Can you see them, five? Yep. They've got a serious problem with their clothes. What is it? Agents ringing in! The girls' clothes are for a man. The clothes don't go with the person who's wearing them. Right, 
Something has been messing about with these clothes. Another call! Quick, we've got more problems. More things that don't belong. Five, you better investigate. I don't think that little person is actually reading that paper. They're both in a place where they don't belong. This could get very dangerous. Who's doing it? I think I can guess. Look. Oh, no! Spooky Spoon! What do we know about her? Here's the info on Spooky Spoon. Uh-oh. One, two, three. She's mean. She's bossy. She's very cruel. She thinks she's great. She thinks she's cool. Five! You've got to stop her! Ah, it's that horrible number jack five! I wonder what you're doing here? I'm here to stop you mixing things up so they don't belong. Oh, really? Well, in that case, you are going to be very disappointed. Because you can't stop me! <laughs> You've got to stop mixing things up. Oh, I don't think so. I think I've got to do it more and more and more. No! Oh, yes! <laughs> like this. Let's see what else I can mix up. Mixing things up so they don't belong. Yes, that's me, Spooky Spoon. We've got to do something, Five. I know. If Spooky Spoon goes on mixing things up, anything could happen. <coughs> she might start mixing things up so creatures are in places where they don't belong. And a hamster can't swim in water like a fish. The dancing cow is happy grazing in a field, but a shark wouldn't be. The birds are happy flying in the sky. Oh, but the dancing cow can't become the flying cow. <coughs> We've got to stop that Spooky Spoon putting things where they don't belong. What's Spooky Spoon going to mix up next? How boring. Everything belongs together. Mm, time for some mixing. Mix. 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 Ah. Uh. Don't eat at that cafe for a start. This is serious, Four. How can Five get things back to normal? Agents ringing in. Spooky Spoon has mixed everything up. Five has to unmix them. Get the things that belong together back together. Stop the mixing, start the matching. OK, Five, you've got to get matching, putting things back where they belong. I'll send some brain gain. Got to get some matching brain game. Think matching. Think matching. Think matching. Match all the sporty things together. Yeah, 
Yes. Match all the cleaning things. You always spoil things for me. <laughs> Good. Match all the food things together. Oh, you think you're so clever, Five? With help from my friends? Yes, I'm clever enough to beat you. But I can go off wherever I like and mix things anywhere. We'll find a way of stopping you. Oh, yes? How? Agent's ringing in. Trap her in a circle. Trap her in a circle with other things that match. We're going to trap you, Spooky Spoon. You'll never do that. There's nothing like Spooky Spoon. Nothing can match with me. We've got to find something that matches a spoon. Quick, any ideas? We need two things that Spooky Spoon matches with. Scanning the cafe. Are there any things that match with the spoon? Anything she belongs with. Agent's ringing it. Match the spoon with the knife. They're both for eating with. Match the spoon with the fork too. Match them. Get them together with a super strong circle. Spoon. Nice. No! What? You're trapped, Spooky Spoon. Trapped with the other things we're eating with. No! I am not like other things! Oh, yes, you are. You're all things to eat with. You've been well and truly matched. And now I can sort out all the things you've mixed up. Come back now, Five. All clear for landing. One, two. Five. You sorted Spooky Spoon out. Think she's better than everyone else, but she's just another thing to eat with. On the screen! There they are in the funny clothes. Don't eat it. Not very healthy food. You can't clean things with a pizza. And you can't play tennis with a mop. Ah! The Spooky Spoon! Five sorted her. Everything back matching where it belongs. And Spooky Spoon trapped in a circle with all the things she matches. All the things for eating with. Well done, Five. Yeah! It's lucky the agent thought of things to match the spoon with. Yes! Knife, spoon, fork. We found three things that match. Things that you eat food with. Can you find three things that belong together in a different way? If you know or have any problems, call the number jacks. The number jacks are on their way! Right. Does everybody know the rules? Yes, yes, yes. I'm not sure. You close your eyes and listen for the bloop ball. If you hear your number, you have to head the ball without looking. Well, it's hard for me, cos I haven't got a very big head. That's cos you haven't got a very big brain. We'll show you how to do it. One. Two, three, four, five, six. See, six bloops. You mean listen, six bloops. Right, your turn to listen. Could be three bloops or four. You've got to listen and count. OK, OK, OK. One. 
One. One. Two. Three. Wait. Ah! Hey, there were three bloops. Yes, and then a fourth one. So? You've got to wait for the last bloop. That gives you the number. It's just calling in. Sorry, bloop ball. Gotta go. We'll be back. We've got a call. Agent 28 here. There's something going wrong. But not for long. Tell us the problem. The girl's got a problem with her clock. Hold on, I'm putting it on screen. Can you see the problem? A missing number. There's three and there's five. But no four. I'm missing. Sounds like a good clock to me. Oh, you. Missing numbers are always a problem and can grow into bigger problems. So we're sending someone out. Great! We're on our way. Thanks. OK, who's going out there? Why is everybody looking at me? Because the missing number was four, so you'd better sort the problem. I'm not sure. You can do it, four, and while you're gone, we'll be the ones who are missing four. Ah. OK, this is a mission for number four. for a four to land on. Hurry up, five. I'm looking. Four's got to have somewhere to land. Where have all the fours gone? Got a four. On screen. Just in time. Oh. Had me worried then. Sorry, Four. Nearly all the Fours seem to have disappeared. You're right. You'd better be careful, Four. You're telling me? Look! Ah! It's the number taker. What do we know about him? Number taker, number taker, have you seen the number taker? Taking all the numbers we can see. Picking, making, getting, writing as mean a number taker as can be. With his number sucker up, he's a number mucker up, but he's as mean a number taker as can be. Watch out, for he might take you. You. Agent's calling in. You've got to go to that girl's house or the party's going to be ruined. Right. And I'll deal with the number taker. <coughs> Later. She looks sad. It's because of the clock. Her party's supposed to start at four o'clock, but now we don't know when it will be four o'clock. You've got to sort that clock, Four. I'll do my best. Here goes. Well done, Four.
table. Now she can have her party. She hasn't noticed me. Make a noise. What noise? Like a clock. Uh, cuckoo, cuckoo. Not a cuckoo clock. <laughs> it's party time. Wait, that big birthday card. I'll do it. Oh no, the cake. The fort's gone from that too. Oh no. You'll be all right for... Oh no! Just keep still for... <sighs> He'll be all right now. Phew. Watch out for... Ah! I need a rest after all that. No time for that. More calls. We've got more problems. Number four is disappearing. No, things disappearing. What's going on? Why did the bowling balls go? And the parcels? <laughs> Agents ring in to help. The balls went from the bowling alley because there was four of them. The number taker likes taking numbers. Now he's taking number fours. And he's taking four things at the time, like the parcels. Thanks, Agents. Things are disappearing when there's four of them. Got to find that number taker. There he is at the cafe. Better get down there, four. OK. If we don't stop the number taker, anything could happen. <coughs> the number taker might take the four legs from a chair. Oh, and the four legs from the table. Or he might take the four fences of a field. And the dancing cow might go dancing off. And then the number taker might take her legs. Better sort that number taker out quick. Be careful, Four. I will. Don't worry. Watch out! There's two glasses. Three. Four! Watch out! Four! Don't let the number taker see you. He likes fours. Don't worry. I've got three menus to hide me. Oh, no! Four menus! for a different four. Wait, what? I've got it. We can't send four ah! things. We can send four noises. Think of the bloop ball. Four sounds. Bloop, 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 bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. Sending brain game. If you like things that come in fast, number taker, here you go. Now we need four people to sort the number taker out. We can get them. 
Let's see him try to suck up those four. They're too big to take, number taker. He's gone! And things are back to normal. Come back now, four. All clear for landing. That number taker is strange. We've got it on screen. The clock was the first thing. And the cake. Careful for... It's dangerous on a birthday cake. It's dangerous everywhere when the number taker's about. Everything in fours. He nearly caught you, four. Great idea sending the sounds. And then four things he couldn't deal with. Four angry people. Yeah! <laughs> we did it! Ready, four? I think it might be your turn. One. Two. Three. Four! Well done, four. I kept my eyes shut and everything. Yeah. You can count things by looking and you can count things by listening. Is there any other way you can count things? How can you count without looking or listening? If you can think how to do it, or if you have any problems, call the number jacks.